As it stands right now, in two weeks' time, the Chicago Bears will be on the clock, 14 days away from the city of Detroit hosting this year's NFL Draft. The three to 400,000 people expected to attend getting around downtown is going to be a little tricky. It is, and today Mayor Duggan and other officials talked about plans to help make it easy as possible for folks to attend. Victor Williams live downtown for us. A lot of people here we're talking about, Victor. Oh yeah, Devin and Karen, we are talking potentially hundreds of thousands of people right here downtown for this event. But get this, don't expect to just come out here and park your car a few blocks away. It's going to be packed. With nearly everyone in the country looking forward to the NFL draft, downtown Detroit is going to be the premier destination that everyone's heading to in just a few days. This is going to be, I think, similar to those who can remember the fireworks in their heyday, when if you weren't here by very early afternoon, you had no hope of driving into downtown. Mayor Mike Duggan making it clear that parking will be extremely hard to come by when the draft is in town. We'll predict that by noon or one o'clock, uh, everything down here will be full. As a result, several alternatives are in place. The People Mover will be running 24-7 for the duration of the draft. You can also take a park and ride trip downtown via the queue line. The Q Line's offering a terrific deal, $5 park and ride, where you can park up a new center, take a short ride down on the Q Line, which is free, um, and be like right in the heart of the action. On top of that, shuttles will be running all throughout downtown, including from the Wayne State area in Corktown. Smart General Manager Dwight Farrell says using his company, however, is a no-brainer for those who have to come from a decent amount away. There will be people who live in Oakland, Macomb, and Wayne counties, for $2, you can take SMART down here and get here. And people who may be in hotels, who couldn't get a hotel in the downtown area, but are in hotels out there, the same thing for them. All of those options are very, very cheap and affordable for anyone who wants to come down here. So obviously, once again, guys, it's best to plan ahead if you are planning to come down here to enjoy the event. But once again, we can't stress this enough, this place is going to be packed. Victor Williams, local four. So the, are those the only options, Victor, you're hearing? Oh, yeah, actually, there are. Check this out. We know you've seen these scooters all around town. A lot of yeah. folks will be able to utilize this as well as the bicycles, the MoGo app, all of that stuff is available as well. Or you can bring your own skateboard, Victor, just for you. Oh, you like <laughs> just reminding you. Yeah, exactly, right? <laughs> all right, skills. Yeah. Oh, yeah.